In the last video we added our resources and uh, thereby we had some uh, conflicts. Our resources were over allocated and uh, there's two ways or there's actually a couple ways that you can fix it. You can uh, right click on it. You can say fix in the task inspector. Uh, you can also say reschedule to the available date. Um, just for the fun of it, I'm going to try to show you that one. Reschedule to available date. Notice I'm finished the 27th of May. The minute I did that, I actually almost added uh, two months to my schedule. Or actually almost three. But I'm going to undo that. Because, again, I have an end date based upon my overall time plan. Uh, the other way was I could uh, fix in task inspector and here I could move task to resources next available time again the problem is it will push this uh, end date forward or I could uh, view in the team planner by clicking on it here I can see every time that I have the team meeting my resources are over allocated uh, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to close this one down, return to my Gantt, and the last option I have, I'm actually just going to go ahead and I'm going to say ignore problem for this task. And what is going to happen is that this task is going to get overtime. So, where was it at? Ignore problems, no problems. Like this. The problem is I am still too expensive. If I look at my overall price, I'm too expensive. I should only cost 90750 so again what I could do I could uh, say is it really necessary to have everybody working on the task at the dual time uh, I could pick this one task one go up under my resource assign resource and say well Bob you're only going to be working 50% on that one uh, close what happens the price lowers a little bit and so forth and that's that's what you need to do to make uh, your period plan uh, fit once you've done that the last thing you need to do before your schedule is finished is uh, yeah where is it there it is under project you need to set baseline like this and then set baseline our entire project and okay once you've done that you cannot do any alterations in your plan because it's now ready for you to like that it's now ready for you to add the actual data but you won't be doing that now you'll be doing that later but that's how you do your period plan for a single phase.